Blueface is facing backlash after asking his son if he's G-A-Y because he was looking for snacks instead of being in the living room with dancers. Come here. There's booty cheeks out here. You in here looking for chips. And Slim Jim. Are you gay? You ain't gay, right? My man. My Lil homie confused why it ain't no food in that big old pantry. Lil buddy starving. Jit looking like where the snacks at? Buddy need groceries, not strippers. He G-A-Y because he hungry? That little dude don't care. He just wanted a Slim Jim. Backlash for what? That's how dads are supposed to act towards their own. When did it become out of pocket to not want your kid to grow up G-A-Y? I'll never have grown naked women around my child. That's just me though. They not even on that type of timing to begin with. He just joking with his son. It's not that deep. Boozy responds to Kodak Black. You ain't never been no street ninja. You a capper rapper. At Boozy Official tweeted out, Sold you sold for a million. I know you would take a D for 20 million. Shake my head, you been weird. You ain't never been no street ninja. You a capper rapper. LOL, Nickelodeon, eh, ninja. LOL, ninja should have stuck they finger in your a-hole. Hashtag Kodak the Stallion. What kind of freaky-ish boozy on? 20 mil for what? Stick your finger where? How you hate G-A-Y-ish, but always saying G-A-Y-ish? Damn, make it make sense. Why dudes always got to talk about D-I-C-K when they arguing? Up too old to be beefing when he only selling 500 copies. Kodak got boozy so mad, buddy done turned freaky. And you sold your car to get a bond. Old heads to say the most fruitiest thing to disrespect you. Boozy, next time, please put pause at the end. Gunna posted Young Thug's QR code. This gonna be hilarious if it's a gunna diss. He said, get y'all apologies ready. Bro, I'm confused. I think it's some inside-ish we don't know about. Thug probably wanted Gunna to be out. Imagine Thug didn't want to mess up his money and told Gunna to take the plea agreement. Thug about to see that check from Gunna's album and smile. This is so hilarious because Gunna released his album through YSL. If he really did snitch, then don't you think Thug wouldn't want him to eat at all? Regardless if he has some level of benefit. Plus, he already made it clear he supported Gunna. People run with the snitch narrative because it's fun at this point. So y'all mad at Gunna and Thug or not? The rap game is finished if Thug is still cool with Gunna. Can we know the dynamic between these two? I'm trying to tell y'all, they still locked in. But he is on trial and can't make a statement about it. 